Quetzal Quetzalcoatl Entertainment presents Quentin's Animation Extravaganza, episode 187, Mark of the Vampire. Animation Land. As you can see, I've just finished my script for Chapter 63 of Himitsu Sentai Go Ranger. Okay, so it's time to check another island in the Orange Archipelago off the list. Today's visit is Moro Island. You're just in time to come with me. Come on, let's go. Ooh, there's a wrecked ship on the shore of this island. Oh, this must be a winner's trophy from many years back. The captain must have competed in the Orange League of Power Pups and won before he died. Well, I've seen just about everything on this island, so let's head back to the Kanto country. Uh, oh my god, get away from me! Oh no, a mechanical monster is attacking a young girl. Apparently this one has a cape and aluminum gloves, but looks just like a mummy. Whatever the case, I must help her. Transformation! Oh! Once I get my hands on you, I'll break your dry flesh to pieces! Where'd he go? What just happened? A mechanical monster abducted a young girl. Oh my god, you gotta save her! There's no telling what that monster will do with her! We'll do our best. Karen, you alert the other jackers while I alert my fellow power buffs. Right! Miyako, come in Miyako! What's the problem? Crime is on the move again. We have to stop them. Right, I'll bring the other power buffs with me! So this mechanical monster looked like a mummy with the cape and aluminum gloves? Indeed he did. We must find him and save that girl. Wait. Why is that girl walking around in a bizarre way? Looks like we gotta help her. Excuse me. Oh my god! I'm saved! What happened? I saw a mummy with a cape and a little gloves. All of a sudden, I was trapped in a broken mirror. I couldn't tell where I was going. A broken mirror illusion! How did this monster even do that? Very simple. Devil Mummy has the power to distort a person's vision. We must find him and save the young girl that he captured. All right, there's the girl. Let's wake her up. What's this? Two small marks on her neck. This could only mean one thing. Devil Mummy is, in reality, a vampire. <laughs> so you finally arrived, Devil Mummy. Watch out! Ah, so you finally figured out my true identity. Well, do you know what they did to the girl? I knocked her out with an injection needle and began to drink her blood. You, ultimate power buff, are destined to get your blood drunk in as well. in hell are you killing my girlfriend and me? Hydro Pump! Ah! Huh? What was I about to do? Never mind that. It's time to finish this blood-sucking mechanical monster off. Ready, Jackers? Ready! Jacka Koba! You're terminated! Huh? Where am I? You're saved. Devil Mummy is gone. You've been brought back to life. All right, let's head back to our homes and take our minds off of this crazy adventure. Wow, 15 adventures with the Jackers so far. I think Crime has only seven mechanical monsters left. <laughs> Prepare for whenever each of those seven attack, okay? All right, see you later. This episode was loosely based on an episode of Jacker Dengeki Tai. Created by Shotaro Ashinomori, copyright 1977. This program is a production of Quetzalcoatl Entertainment.
This is PBS, the public broadcasting service.